Hello and welcome back. My name is Desiree. This is Mechanical Mastery. We're here on our lovely island. How's everybody doing today? I hope you're doing well. So we got some fun, fun, fun stuff planned for today. Um, we got this thing automated here, which is awesome. But the problem is we keep running out of the essences. So what I've been doing... You didn't see that. Uh, what I've been doing recently is I've been just manually crafting them and then chucking them over there. That's too much work. So let's auto craft them. Um, I did make this. So we've got another little platform down here and that's where we're going to, we're going to run it. We're just going to do a little more automation down here. Um, probably expand that a little bit as well. But the idea is I need to make I'm going to just add the sawmill in. I forgot to do that in my episode prep. Um, so we have the effigies, right? So we have the dormant and then we have the four that we need to do. Uh, any one of these we can fluid encapsulate. So we just get destabilize redstone put it in here plus an effigy and we get the basals one and then we put it in a sawmill and it's one to one um yeah so we're probably also going to need a pulverizer so we're going to need four of each of these because i'm just going to build them on individual systems um just to make life easy but let's start out we'll get Four magma crucibles. More of these, please. Uh, what? Is that just a blaze spawning? That was weird. That sounded like a blaze spawning. <laughs> Let's just make a stack of those. Uh, no, I need the... We're done with those. I need this. Three of those. Cool. Chapter complete. What am I missing? Um, it is cheaper to go up and do that in a manual, manual system, but it's not really worth it, in my opinion. Oh. My short on. All right, so we probably like four pulverizers is a little much, but whatever. And then we need a flex point. This is awesome. We've got some cables here. Probably need a couple more things as well. Like we got to process the. Um, well, we should process the redstone, but I'll probably just export that from our, uh, our AE system here. Let me just expand this out so it's the same size as the upstairs. Just so that when we go to put more stuff down here, it, it lines up properly, right? Um, I have to go all the way around to get there. Okay. 
put that there as a guide. Okay, we can go one more. Um, on this side, looks like we can go about that far. Yeah, cool. And then, yeah, we can't quite, we don't quite have enough right now, but that's okay. Um, I'm going to make one more of these lantern thingies. set up there all right so we're gonna start the automation here move these up so we can have access to all of our machines so we need a magma crucible into the fluid encapsulator into the sawmill into a pulverizer And we'll do this three times or four times here. Sweet. I like the way that looks. It's kind of a cool, cool setup. Um, no, I don't think, yeah, we're definitely going to need more. Probably set up a crafting recipe for this stuff. But let's go uh, alloy. Yeah, apparently I can't do that, but that's fine. And then go underneath here. We'll take this stuff out. And then the four items that we're going to need. So we need lava, which is easy enough to make. Um, yeah, let me, let me wire this first and then we'll, we'll talk about that. And boom. Awesome. So everything has power now. Um, so if we look at effigies, we need redstone, glowstone, ender pearls, and lava. Um, So we're going to do lava first. I have item or a frame. Exactly how many I needed. I'm just going to do this so I know what's up. Okay. 
So this one we're going to need netherrack in to make the lava, which is easy enough. Um, we do this. We can set this up that it's going to export the destabilized redstone to the right. This one's going to import on the right, export on the left. Uh, this one's also probably going to import on the back because we'll need the effigies. Um, this one's going to import, export, import, export. Cool. Um, input, export. Same thing. And I know that these are more efficient if I run with blocks. I know. But it's okay. It's okay. Actually, those are probably the same. Um, so we'll do this one as well. Auto output that one. Okay. Actually, you know what? Because I don't need a ton of these. Why don't we do this? We'll put a drawer on top with a single oh, I haven't even done this one. Um with a single stack, kinda like we did with the blaze. Because then we can have some fun and back stuff everything. Uh, and we can just controller, like storage controller kind of thing that, um, okay. So that gets us all of this. This is taking forever, but that's okay. So what do we need now? We need, um, We need a bunch of refined storage cable. And where's the easiest place to run it down? I'm going to pick this up for a second and we'll just use this spot. I don't know where that external storage just went. Weird. Okay. Um... That's right. I have to do exporters. Let's do exporter. Let's make 16 of them. Which seems like a lot, but... Okay. This one I'm actually going to run differently because I'm just going to do an EMC link right there. Um...
Uh, oak drawers one one. And then we need this one. Always short on the easiest things. Okay, and then I need external. I just go get the uh, crafting recipe for this installed. I don't think I need to go that high right now, but at least that's in there. External, one, two, three, four. Uh, and then I also need four crafting. Craft this. Okay, sweet. Because I know how to craft the effigies, so. Oop. I can actually go along and remove these. I want these all to be external storages. Cool. Um, that is the sound of a blaze spawning, is it not? Oh my, it's going to be a little expensive to get rolling, but that's okay. Um, I just have to sneeze, sorry. Excuse me. So we'll put that in there. Um, put that in there. And then lapis was the other thing, right? Actually, what am I doing? What's the best way to do this? Can we enrichment chamber it? Yeah. Um, we are going to not eject to the top here.
and say bye bye to this setup. So we don't need that anymore. Forty six. So that's going to start crafting all of that stuff um, so that when I do this, these are all just full. Um, this one is going to be redstone. So I have, I think I can do this to be honest. It knows the recipe for that, yeah. Because that's going to pull out, a, that's essentially an extra redstone, so. Oh man, we are low on that as well. So that's going to be, uh, next episode's fun is making sure we have enough of everything. Probably EMC link, um, redstone and lapis into a a thingy. Um, should we just? We should probably just EMC link this too, right? That's uh, two. I need Inver. Yeah, we'll set that up down here as well. Um, Okay, so that's going to make this, let's test out the system. We're sawmilling. We're pulverizing. And we're definitely going to have to, uh, my goodness. Let's definitely do that. Okay. So that is making waste powder. So that's cool. Uh, this one, I need an effigy and one of these. Of course, we're missing redstone now, so I can't do that, but that's okay. We're going to almost get it ready. Lock, lock, lock. Gonna export ender pearls. Um, let's go over here. Like I said, we're gonna we're gonna automate this next episode, but as of right now, I need just some to get me through. Um
Let's just put this up in here. Give it a little bit of a head stir here. There we go. Look at that. Doing great. We're totally able to keep up as well. Why? Oh, haha! <laughs> That's fun. Okay. That should be able to sustain. I just want a crafting upgrade. Can I just have one more crafting upgrade, please? Before you burn all the redstone. Please. Please. Maybe I need to turn this thing off downstairs just for one second. Uh, yeah, the effigies are getting in the way. What is it? The pulverizer? Come on, silly machine. I just need some silicone. We just manually do it here. That's not the recipe. Also not the recipe. Stop it. <laughs> this thing's crazy fast now because of below. Yeah. Sometimes you just need to manually do it. Um, okay, so if we go down here, we can now set this up. So dormant effigy. This should all work. Right? So one stack, one stack, one stack. This stuff is going to start to back up. It's going to take a while. But eventually we'll have a fully back stuffed. I'm going to have to worry about these other items, aren't I? Yeah. But if I do powder now... There. Those just popped up. Just see these numbers changing here just to make sure. Yeah. 
Awesome. So there we go. We can now, if we go up here, it's probably crafting again. Because that system is automated. It's expensive. It's going to clog up our resources, and we probably should make a different set of these because it's going to bung up the system. But once we get it rolling, it should be pretty quick. Like, if you look at the... Um, essences so if you look here like one of these lightning charges requires one blitz powder and you get two per moat right three per moat so for each one you're making you're making three so you're getting three times return on it so it's going to be pretty going to be pretty quick so um yeah i think that's all i got for today so we got that stuff automated. Um, looking forward in the quest book here, we're going to start to do the wither, um, automating withers, withers, all that kind of stuff. Actually, if we go back. Oh, my God. Sorry, my voice just disappeared. I don't know what that was. Um, um, we can finish that to get that stuff, but that's not super important that's an optional quest there so um yeah it said we completed it but we have already completed it. So that's gonna do it for me today hope you had a fantastic day thank you so much for tuning in if you did enjoy the video click like if you want to see more videos like this make sure you click subscribe because it'll be them coming out three times a week uh, as well as more stuff once we're through this series um, but we still got a lot to go on here so um until next time, my name is Deseret. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Bye-bye.